Hey everyone, if you're struggling to lose weight and you're really struggling for real, not BS, not where you just have body, uh, body image issues or where you don't quite understand, you know, uh, whether you're healthy or not, when you're truly overweight and you know it, you know it, you just know it and you want to lose the pounds, right? Uh, the reason you're not able to do it is simple, right? There's one big simple overarching reason. And that is because you're not engaged with reality, right? With ultimate reality, including the body you see when you look down, when you look in the mirror, including the body in a robust warrior-like way. Whether you're a woman or a man, you have to engage with the world. You have to engage with yourself. You have to engage with everything in a robust where you're like way the kind of way where you're you're willing to take feedback you're willing to be uncertain you're willing to be a little scared but where you really are just trying to be the best you can be give the best impact you can be to the world be as robust as strong as you could possibly be for yourself first and also for those you love when you have that kind of mentality your mind naturally naturally will think okay what do I need to do in each part of my life, whether that's finances, health, strength, relationships, my mind, my heart, my spiritual life, whatever. You could break it down. You could even break fitness down. You could say strength, flexibility, uh, cardio. You could break it down even further. What kind of flexibility? What kind of cardio? What kind of strength? Right? The kind of You could break strength down, let's say, into uh, actual strength where your goal is just to be able to... to you know, push as much muscle as you can, or size, where you're just interested in size, but you don't really care about how much you're pushing, right? Your goal is more to look bigger, not necessarily to be stronger. Both are relevant, both are interesting. And the same thing could be said about almost any endeavor in in kind of your path, your, your self-development, self-improvement path. So you can't take out, you just cannot, never going to happen. You can't take out weight loss, fitness, anything health related, but specifically weight loss. You just cannot, cannot take it out of a broader self-development, self-improvement program. You're always going to hit a wall. You're always going to have trouble. You're always going to only last for a little bit with your success with that. Um, if you don't, it, it, with losing weight, if you don't, incorporated as a part of a true self-development program if it's just about losing weight if it's just about looking better if it's just about feeling better especially which is really uh not a great necessary not the best path to go let's say feeling better always um then you're not gonna you're not gonna succeed it'll it'll be momentary and then you'll you'll go back go back to being you know what you don't want to be so the way you fix it is you put it in the context of a broader self-development program and you expand the goal big time, right? You From a small, stupid, pathetic, weak, insecure goal, right? Of losing weight, wanting to look good. the kind, uh, the, That kind of goal, that this kind of goal, losing weight, wanting to lose weight, it just shows you how vain you are, how insecure you are, how like, how pathetic you are in a way. How like, what are you focused on, dude? What are you focused on? You're focused on losing weight? There's so many big problems in the world. Of course it's going to be hard, dude. Of course. You think it should be easy because you really want it. You really want to look good. But it's just, it's a selfish, vain approach. But when you approach it in a far grander, bigger perspective, when you say, I need to lose weight. I need to be robust. I need to be fucking fit. Very fit. My cardio needs to be top. My strength needs to be top. I need to look good and I need to feel good. When you say that, that's different. But why? Why are you saying it? The only reason, the only way, the only approach is when you uh, put it into a, a, a broader self-development program. I feel like I'm saying it confusingly. So why are you saying these things? Why are you saying I want to be robust and fit? So first of all, I'm saying stop saying I want to lose weight. The goal should be far greater than that. But that goal is couched, is, is inside another broader goal. That's being a warrior, being a big, great, amazing person for yourself and for those you love. If you don't have that as your goal, if your main goal isn't to be the best version of yourself, if your main goal is just to lose weight, then you're not going to lose weight. If your main goal is just to look a little better in the mirror and not be the best you person you can be, period, mentally and physically, 
It's going to be hard to lose weight. It's going to be hard to look better in the mirror. But when you say, forget losing weight, forget getting strong, forget cardio, forget all that nonsense. Stupid, stupid things to talk about and think about. My, what I'm going to think about, what I'm going to talk about every day in my mind is how can I be the best I can be? the most robust I can be, the strongest I can be, the most fit I can be, the most capable I can be, the most intelligent I can be, the nicest I can be, the most sweet and gentle I can be. How? Well, many ways, many ways. Some of them involve learning. Some of them involve going to do exercise. Some of them involve talking to people, many ways. But in that program, in that path, in that approach, obviously, obviously, it's going to be clear that losing weight, getting fit, getting stronger, looking better, feeling better, being more robust in every way, being more flexible, having a better body, having a better monkey like this, having a better one of these walking around with you, you're going to realize that that's a good thing. That's a beneficial and positive thing. And then it'll be a little easier because instead of focused on being focused on some narrow vein goal, you're going to have a much broader goal, right? And it sounds like, yeah... Come on, dude. It sounds ridiculous, right? But it's not. It's not. There's magic to it. There's true magic to it. There's something inside you that knows, that knows how vain and pathetic the goal of losing weight is. It knows it. And it knows that the goal of being an amazing, amazing person, being the best version of yourself, it knows that that is an amazing goal. And it'll help you pursue that goal. So you need better goals.